Ah, there you are, Butthole. What have you found, Super Craig? Timmy's phone has a bunch of notes in it. Something about a girl who has information about all the criminal activity in town. What girl? It just says, find the girl with the dick tattoo. Well, what girl in town has a dick tattoo? I don't know, Mosquito. But the Freedom Pals must think she's the key to finding the missing cat. If the Freedom Pals find her before we do, they'll get the $100 reward. We cannot let that happen. We have to stop the Freedom Pals from having a sweet franchise. At all costs. Then we have to find the girl with that tattoo tonight. Fast Pass is right. We all have to sneak out of our houses tonight and search the entire town. What do you say, new kid? Are you up for it? Look, if you want to be a coon friend, you have to learn to communicate. Yeah, who let this guy join us anyway? Go easy on him, you guys. He's had a tough life. When he was six years old, his dad fucked his mom. What? I'm sorry, friend, but it's time they learned your tragic backstory. Butthole doesn't trust anyone because his dad fucked his mom and he couldn't do anything to stop it. That doesn't make any sense. I know. How could the person you trust do that to the only other person you love? Carmen, everyone's dad fucked everyone's mom. Huh? That's how it works, stupid. Our dads fucked our moms. Oh, right. So does that mean your dad fucked your mom, Cam? Huh? Yes! My dad fucked my mom. That's why I'm here. Don't steal his backstory, dude. That's not cool. You're so fucking stupid! Every human alive on Earth had a dad who fucked their mom stop, and... Stop, stop. This is not what's important right now. We need to find the lady with the dick tattoo. Yeah, let's get home so we can prepare for evening mission. Let's go, coon friends. He's such a fucking idiot. It's okay. Calm down. I'm afraid you'll have to deal with that kind of bigotry your whole life, butthole. When people don't understand, they lash out. I'm going to let you be a sidekick tonight to one of the coon friends. Go home and sneak out after your parents are asleep. I'll fill you in later. What are you doing even talking to the school counselor? Why'd you answer the phone? Have you lost your fucking mind? Our child felt the need to go talk to the school counselor. Doesn't that bother you at all? So you told him the truth? No, we didn't talk about that at all. You dumb bitch! You'll ruin everything! I don't have to listen to this from a stoned-out pothead! I need a drink. Sure, drown your problems in Chardonnay, you stupid skank! Oh, hey, whippersnapper! Have a fun day out playing? <laughs> well, I'm exhausted. Gonna get ready for bed. Dinner's on the table if you want it, punk. But then straight to bed, okay? Pothead. Alcoholic. Sweetie, I just want you to know that whatever happens, Mommy always loved you. Good night, sweetheart. That time, that's when the creeps come out. But unfortunately for the creeps, the other thing that comes out at night is a key.
of diabetes at his control. I used to be a simple elementary school student, but then one day, a freak science accident turned my diabetes into superhuman strength. All right, sidekick, we're supposed to go investigate a girl who might know the location of the missing cat. Follow me. Ready? Let's go, sidekick. Kyle is his wife. I'm pretty much like Bruce Banner. A loner, hoping to one day cure my diabetes, and yet knowing it means I'll no longer be able to fight crime. Fuck it, bitch! Let's see how you like this! I am Captain Diabetes, and this is my faithful sidekick! Oh, okay. Well, move out of the way, huh? I need to go buy some more beer. I'm sorry, but Captain Diabetes cannot let you drive! I'm fine to drive, okay? Get out of here! Hey, give me my keys! You are in no condition, sir! I'm fine, okay? Look, wait, look, look! I'm fine, okay? Give me my keys, please. I'll return them tomorrow. Give me my fucking keys, you little shit! You think I can dance with this? Let's go! Take care, sidekick. Even debilitated, this is a dangerous foe. I'm not debilitated, I'm just jovial. my drink! Alright, you're gonna get... Totally impervious to pain! Give me my fucking keys! Still bleeding? I guess I better just drink more to replace my lost fluids. You really need to sign up for AA, Mr. Mark. You're no match for Captain Diabetes and his crusty sidekick! I can take it! We can all go to the store together. You, you drive. I was not. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How'd I end up over here? Stop him, sidekick. Anymore. What do you say you just give me those keys? No can do, Mr. Ah. I'm fine to drive. I'm fine. Okay, okay. Okay, now I'm fine. You should be fine to drive at approximately 11 a.m. tomorrow. It's 11 a.m. somewhere. on another mission right now. We're on our own, sidekick. It's up to us to get to the bottom of this. The shortcut's up there in the attic. The coon gave us permission to use it. Sometimes, when I have too much sugar, that's one second. <laughs> this is Humankind's secret base. Farts make me angry. The coon says it's because my mom farted when she gave birth to me, and that's why I have diabetes. I, I don't think that's why I have diabetes, though. I think it was a gift to help fight crime. The shark kind of threw that window. I don't have my own secret base, but if I did, at least I'll clean it up before I knew I had super guests coming over. Couldn't even set up the ladder for us. Gee. Well done, sidekick. This shortcut will take us right into the heart of downtown South Park. Come on, Jackie. Do not be afraid. The fearless hero in his sidekick descends into the dark night, ready to strike down evil and bring peace to the city. No, 
don't think people get diabetes because their mom started doing childbirth, do you? I, I feel like Kuhn made that up to make Captain Diabetes feel insecure about himself. As you can see, Sidekick, at nighttime, South Park is quite a different place. We've got to get into the Peppermint Hippo, to the town square. <laughs> in the fucking world. They could have me if they wanted to. They have me? Yeah, country music rules. My diverse rage will do just a trick. Oh my god, here it comes. Yes, no much sort of... Yeah! Okay, too much. Need insulin. Need to get fast. Uh, and I am back to normal. You see how masterfully I have learned to control my diabetes. Follow me this way. Here it is. Here's where we're going to find the girl. There are sure to be unsavory characters and lots of boobies inside. Come on, let's go inside. Hey, beat it, kids. 21 and over only. Turn this high, citizen. It is I, Captain Diabetes. I must speak with the ladies inside. Get out of here before I fucking throw you out. What to do? Hmm, there must be another way in somewhere. Great detective work, Psychic. Now we just need a way up there. Over here, Psychic. I have an idea. Oh, of course. Stand aside, Psychic. here to talk, baby. Yeah, no talking until you finish grinding on our chubs. Oh, all right. Okay, sidekick. You know what this means. <sighs> mm. 
Look, I'm not gonna pay for this. Oh, no! Oh, come on, you're killing my buzz here. Come on! What kind of move was that? Oh, fuck! Jesus, babe, you're stinking up the VIP room. Uh. Oh, Ray! Ah. Oh, I'm gonna blow up! Oh, no! Look, I'm not gonna pay for this. Oh, come on, you're killing my buzz here. Come on! What the fuck? Oh no, stop. Let's, let's just talk. Let's just talk. Okay, chat time. Chat time? Aw, oh, man. So, what kind of work do you guys do? And did you ever dance with a girl here who has a penis tattoo? Why do you keep talking about a stripper with a penis tattoo? Yeah, yeah, Classy, that's her name. Her name is Classy? Yeah, Classy with an I, and a little dick that hangs off the C, which fucks the L out of the ASS. Of course, hence the tattoo. We have the name, new kid, come on. What are you talking about? This is the worst VIP experience ever. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. You ain't going nowhere. Ha-ha, I am the ordinary stripper. I am Captain Diabetes. What? My sidekick and I simply used our powers of disguise to extract information from you. Hey, you won't get away with this, Captain Diabetes. Oh, shit, my boner is weighing me down. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. I know a strip club that only has one dollar symbol on Yelp. Now I'm getting my money's worth. I want to go to one of those. Let's expedite this combat, sidekick. Classy, can't wait. Anyone like a dad? Last time I paid for a high priced twenty dollar stripper. I got a group on that'll get me and four friends thirty percent off chub if we show up for seven. Hey, get your pants teach you not to hit strippers. Uh. Why the economy call? Oh. Oh. You got your dance, you smelly old man. No refund. <laughs> Give up, sticky man. It's two against one now. <laughs> See the manager if you have any complaints about your lap dance experience at the Peppermint Hippo, gentlemen. Adieu. Guys, hope you're having a good night out there. Be sure to tip your waitresses and maybe buy a drink for the DJ. Next up on the main stage, we've got a little bit of hot sauce coming up your way. Let's give it up for Esmeralda. That's it. The DJ calls the bitches names, and then the bitches come out of that back room. Nukin, we need to find a way to distract the DJ. <gasps> I got it. Gin and tonics always make my mom pass out. If we can make one and spike it with something really strong, he'll be out for sure. Go make that drink, sidekick. There's One taste of that spicy everywhere. snatch of her goner. Next up is cinnamon. Hey, that looks like something we can put in a drink. Ah, that was... Ah, that was... Is that good, sidekick? Let's keep looking. Addition to our concoction. 
Okay, whose kids are you? Get back here before I get you in trouble! Please put your hands together for destiny. That's really nice of you. That went down really good. The DJ sure does appreciate it. Ugh. Oh, oh man, I think someone farted in my drink, guys. I'll be right back. Be sure to tip your winters. Great work, new kid. Wow. All right, guys, put your hands together. Be sure to tip your winters. Good things are about to get a little bit hotter than they did. Please blossom. Bless it. Uh, that's right, guys. Let's get her all out here. That's classy with an eye and a little dick that fucks the hell out of the ASS. Give it up for classy. Hey, what you calling me out for? I ain't on stage yet. Wait a minute. You ain't the DJ. That must be her new kid. Oh, shit. It's 5 0. Cops are here. After her. You know you're such a little. No 
Nobody's allowed back here. Yeah, get lost. Stand aside, ladies. Captain Diabetes and his sidekick need to question that stripper. You want to get to her? You're going to have to go through us. Bring it on. All right, guys, this is your DJ back from the bathroom. Looks like we've got a special treat for you tonight. The two assholes that farted in my drink are about to get fucked in the face by our very own lovely ladies. comes our favorite flower of fellatio. Give it up for Fuchsia. Spicier in here, oh, that's why it's Esmeralda. We can't let her get away, Cat Cat. Take them out, bitches. What you waiting for? Yeah, I got my stank on that one. in from the day shift, give it up for Blaze. Hey, can we turn the house lights down just a touch? We can't let her get away, Sidekick. Get down, Sidekick. She can smash a watermelon between her thighs. It's Anastasia. We've got to catch Classy. Down the hallway, Sidekick, quick, quickly. We gotta stop those tiny cups from catching Classy. Get yeah. them. Get the cover. It's right in pussy. Bitch slap your mama like that, shame on you. Oh, you little bastards done fucked up. Go get him, Boote. Look out, ladies and gents, here comes the queen of creepies, the mistress of BDSM, your dominatrix dream come true. It's spontaneous Boote. Hey, honey, you ain't ready for this Boote. I'm gonna crush you in my booty cheeks. Let me sit on your face real quick. Classy! Ah! Check this shit! 
it out. Is that good for you, too? Get over here, sugar. I'm coming. If you run now, you may live to brag about this. You never forget your first stripper, right, sidekick? Two time. Sorry, ladies, we'll take a ring with you. Let's get out of here. My turn. You think she's okay? Don't tell Kuna said that. Come and get me, boys. Ready or not, I'm coming. Okay. You don't stand a chance against an ass that size! Time, honey. I'm gonna go rest my bouquet. to use this thing. Come on, you kid! Into the restaurant! We just gotta lift that sign! Send the sign, sidekick! It is time for Diabetic Rage! Even my diabetic rage can't move this sign. <sighs> oh, God. <sighs> it's too much. I need my insulin. My... I need my... Oh, no. Oh, God. I'm out of insulin. You got to help me. I drank the apple juice, but I don't have any insulin. I'm going into diabetic shock. I'm, I'm dying. Oh, God. Mom. Mom, I'm dying. Somebody, please. Please. <gasps> This is Coon checking in. How's it going for you guys? Everything cool over there? Okay, keep me updated. You know what makes my fart super bad? Handcrafted text mix. Text mix. Not just any handcrafted text mix. It's got to be something extra special. You know what to do, new kid. Uh, 
I'm alive? What happened? Who are you? Huh? Wait a minute. What happened? I thought I died from diabetes. I remember seeing a bright light. The hand of God reaching towards me. Then somebody farted in my face and I was back. I can almost still smell it. Wow, your farts can actually move objects in time. That's impressive. Now let's get back to that stripper. Two friends. We found a female, but she's escaped to the Italian restaurant. Requesting backup. You heard him. All crew friends to the book of the Fagagini. And I said, you know what your problem is? You're an alcoholic. <laughs> you didn't. I did. I said, I said, you can't even go a day without scotch? You lush. <laughs> I just don't get how these people can get high every night and feel like it's okay. Oh, I... I mean, I'm sorry, but if you're sticking a cat's ass in your face, you... There they are. Where's the girl? She was just here. You didn't see her come in? Uh, no, we were busy sinking our watches. No, we were looking at menus because Cartman made us order food. Fighting crime on an empty stomach is very dangerous, human cat. It's for your own good. Whatever. She couldn't have left. We would have seen her go out the front door. Well, then maybe she's in the back. Okay, you guys check it out. Call us if you need help. We'll be waiting for you with our breadsticks. Stand back. The real superheroes are here, Nam. Yeah, us real superheroes are here to save the day. <laughs> Watch and learn, newbie. The coon's on deck. The rest of you, try not to die. Get coon. <laughs> You're gonna clean so many pots and pans for that? Hey kid, you ever been spatchcocked before? I don't like the sound of that. Your turn is now property of Coon and Friends. I'm gonna force feed you corn and harvest your fatty liver. Hold still! Uh. You want a cream fresh bukake with that? Hell fucking no. Sorry to break up the pizza party. Hey, I only take abuse from the head chef in this kitchen. You're about to become just another stain on my apron. Bottoms are up. Mm. Oh, me, mama, I'm like a lamb to the slaughter. This one bleeds real nice. I'm gonna show you why kids ain't allowed back here. <laughs> That's tenderizing. Fuck, I'm dripping all over the place. <laughs> Pretend that really hurt. My friends are watching. I'm sending you home to Mama in the doggy bag. This kitchen is about to heat up. Now that's how you give this stink eye. Tell them what you're made of, butthole. 
Boys, got a uh. make way for diabetes. Diabetes, you bastard. My body is sacred, like it's a saint to Joseph's altar. I'm gonna turn you into a brachiola that makes it the mouth water. Uh. Uh. Oh, I'm up. Okay. Kid, I'm gonna do something fucking sweet. <laughs> now go tell everyone you cut yourself manscaping. Well <laughs> Really good feeling about this, guys. Here coming through. <laughs> Looking sharp, Coon. Damn right, diabetes. I'm gonna put boogers and cum all over you, little fuckers. <laughs> yeah. You ever clean out a grease trap, kid? Well, you're gonna. <sighs> Duty calls. Hey, <laughs> I'm pretty yeah. sure I can fit your whole body in a stock pot, little shit. I still make you a squeal like a sow. Hmm. Oh. Human kite, ready to swoop. Here, dude. Fuck him up, I hope. New kid. Step aside, coon friends. Daddy's home. Make way for coon. We got this guy. Captain Diabetes, into the fray. Making you flat like a pizza. Ha. Oh, you fuck with the coon. You answer to his friends, right, guys? Yeah, yeah, we'll get around to it. <sighs> coon won't last long at this rate. Thank you, Leo. The coon always recommends carrying protection. Give him hell, douchebags. We're gonna go do some real superhero shit. Oh, 
Great Crusaders were no match for the Kunin friends. Huh, sidekick? Clashy must have gone this way, but the path is barricaded. I could easily lift this out of our way, but I can't use my apple juice without insulin to bring me back down. Ugh. Wait, that's it? Your farts, sidekick! Your terrible farts that throw me into fits of rage! Of course! The coon wasn't trying to make me feel insecure when he told me that my mom's farts gave me diabetes. He was trying to help me unlock my true powers! We've got to get through there and get the classy sidekick for the good of South Park. For Coon and friends, I need you to fart on my face. Don't be shy. All right, ready when you are. Of myself. But if we're ever in a dire situation like that again, Psychic, know that you can fart in my face. Hold on, sidekick. Sounds like there could be trouble behind that door. There's someone in there. Get ready. One, two, diabetes! <laughs> See, I told you the cops were chasing me. And you led them here, you stupid bitch? Uh-uh. Who are you calling a stupid bitch? Do I look like your mama? That gang is up, classy! These kids are cops? That ain't no cop. That's Captain Diabetes. When he was born, his mom farted during labor and it gave him diabetes that he uses to fight crime. And that is not how people get diabetes. If they aren't cops, then we can shoot them, along with this bitch, too. Oh, shit. Y'all turning on me? I knew I shouldn't have went into business with y'all Tony Soprano-looking motherfuckers. So long, Captain Diabetes. Let's see your diabetes save you now. Uh-oh. Ah! What the? I want my keys! I don't have your keys, man. <laughs> She's wasted on red wine. Red wine drunk is the worst drunk there is. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here. All right, Captain Diabetes. This is it. Give me my fucking keys. You are in no condition to drive. Then die. Mr. March, let me call your wife. Leave Sharon out of this, you little prick. Yeah. 
prepare for a vicious squinting. Why you keep letting him hit you like that? Duck or something? Now you're gonna get it. Damn, they got you all weak and shit. You better not lose, nigga. Shit, shit, hang on, Sharon's texting me. I can't type. Why the fuck can't I type? Why are my thumbs so big? Hey Siri, fucking take a note and tell my wife to fuck off because I'm fighting. Poop emoji. Villainy will never defeat Kunin, friends. Yeah. Oh shit, that looked like it hurt. You cannot have your key. Oh man, looks like I bet on the wrong horse. Punch tower! Once again, the tune saves the day. Alright, I'm gonna take a cab. Nobody drinks and drives on Captain Guy Lady Watch. Aight, aight, shit. Look, all I know is there's a kingpin trying to get new high-grade drugs out on the street. It's somebody trying to bring the Italians and Chinese crime families together and shit. Enough small talk. Where is Scrambles? Scrambles? We need this reward money for our superhero franchise. Oh, shit. Y'all just want a cat? So then there's Cisco. He just some low-class asshole started working two months ago. He be talking all this shit about making money off the crime in the city because some big shot white boy be running all the drugs and all the hookers and shit, right? Okay. Uh-uh, but not me. I'm my own pimp, you know what I'm saying? It's like I got one investment in this world, and that's my pussy, and I ain't putting no mortgage on that to some high-paying nigga talking about trying to make more money off crime and shit. Classy, classy, I'm sorry, but what what about the cats? Oh, that cats? Okay, that's this little Asian freak named Yakibaba or some shit like that. He going around paying all these little sixth graders to take people's cats. That's fucked up. I think taking that pussy and, like, taking mine, you know what I'm saying? That's like criminal shit. Where do the cats go? I can tell you, but I ain't saying shit until I know I'm safe, you understand? These niggas ain't playing, and I need to know you gonna protect my ass. Eric Cartman, do you have any idea what time it is? This is a school night. Mom, not now. We're seriously onto something. You kids all get home now, or I'm calling your parents. Sorry, Mrs. Cartman. Please don't tell my mom. And who is this stripper woman? These coon friends offer me protection. Well, she's not staying here. Fine, fast pass, take her to your house. Okay. And now, the news program that starts your day off right. Good morning, South Park. Good morning, South Park. A new vigilante took to the streets last night and has apparently single-handedly taken down the Famboni crime family. Here with more is a midget in a bikini. Tom, I'm standing outside the Boca de Fagaccini where the vigilante declared war on crime in South Park. Security camera footage showed a young person farting in people's faces on their balls. It was just terrifying. The kid came in and just started farting on people. It was out of nowhere, man. Maybe someone's finally standing up to what's wrong with this city. This new kid's a hero. The kid's a menace, if you ask me. How long before he or she kills an innocent person? How long before Daredevil becomes the Punisher? Huh? Three seasons? Three seasons! Police called to the scene found a treasure trove of illegal items that they claim might tie the Italian restaurant to a larger crime syndicate. This may be just the tip of the iceberg. Certainly chilling stuff, and there are reports the vigilante possibly had a sidekick? 
There was thought to be a sidekick, Tom, but further investigation showed it was just some little twerp with diabetes. Thanks, Midget, and of course, the question on everyone's minds now, who is the farting vigilante? This is going to make us look bad. You fucked up. It wasn't our fault. This kid just came into the restaurant and started farting like there was no tomorrow. All you Italians are supposed to do is move the product. The Chinese and Russians do the rest. Everything has to be discreet and quiet, or people are going to learn the truth. That we put the product into people's drugs and alcohol in order to create more crime. You just keep doing your part in getting the cheese out on the streets. Or maybe I'll start dealing directly with the Russians. Or the Chinese. Or the sixth graders. What a great sleep. Yeah, I haven't slept that well in weeks. <sighs> so, you guys do anything interesting last night? Oh, no, you know, the usual. Just watched some TV and went to bed. Yep, nothing exciting in our b boring lives. Well, then, I guess I'll just be seeing you guys tomorrow. You've got a big day ahead of you, new kid. Get changed into your superhero costume and wait for a message from the king. How do you do that? That was dumb. All right, Bud Lord. It's time for us to get the information we need from Classy. Any good superhero should know how to interrogate. Get over to Jimmy's house and find out what she knows. Keen, act. Assertive. Yeah, but not too assertive, or her snow boss will think she's a snow bitch. Shoo! I don't want your low social status rubbing off on me. You're turning into kind of a big deal, new kid. What do you say? Selfie? Okay, well, full disclosure, Esther's not following you, so I'm not following you, so don't tag me, thanks. Oh, me next! Shoo! I don't want your low social status rubbing off on me. You want some of this, Forthy? That's what I thought. <laughs> 